Welcome back to Weekly Mod! Today we have some incredible Clone Wars mods for Battlefront 2 and even for Jedi Fallen Order. You don't want to miss this. Our first mod is the Republic Commandos Delta Squad mod by Junior Marte. This mod changes Han to Boss, Leia to Scorch, Lando to Fixer, and Finn to Sev. Everyone's favorite Blue Imperial strategist, Grand Admiral Thrawn, has been added to Battlefront. And Sorox has finished his incredible Aayla Secura mod. There is a Season 7 Clone Wars front end music mod, and an Order 66 sad front end music mod, if you want to get deep in the feels. Hey dummy, I'm gonna call you Darth Matt from now on. As in, what do you call a guy with no arms and no legs laying on the front porch? Matt. Darth Matt. Okay, okay, it's okay. If you ever wanted to play as a burnt Anakin Skywalker, this file by CR Mods will surely pleasure your fantasy. And timed with the end of the Clone Wars, Poet has released a detailed Captain Rex mod for Lando and the Cobalt Arc Trooper. It's also compatible with his Commander Cody mod. Caleb2432 and Smug Chewbacca have also released a really dope Commander Fox, everyone's favorite clone commander. If you want to spice up your Battle of Geonosis, download the Attack of the Clones Phase 1 Overhaul mod. This mod brings in the clone Shiny, Sergeant, Lieutenant, Captain, and Commander seen in Episode 2. Wax Movie Loading Screens replaces the loading screens with scenes from the movies. And if you remember the TIE Striker from Battlefront 1 and Rogue One, Stallion has ported over the TIE Fighter. What's better than Republic Commandos? Flying Republic Commandos! If you like hoodies, then you'll love the Count Dooku Hooded and Hood Down mod. Dooku. If you have a life and haven't unlocked the 5000 kill old master skin, not to fret, any made a mod. And there's a caped mall mod. Kenobi! Fitting with the end of Battlefront 2, the Spartan CV made a music mod that replaces Scarif's loading screen music with Crab Rave. For those of you hoping to play as Maul with a Zabrak heavy skin, you can now customize your skin color. And for those of you who remember the Alderaan Honor Guards, you can now play as them in Battlefront 2. Last week, I showed the Captain Fordo mod, and it has now been updated to include his Phase 1 version. One in the rubble. Sir! Another in the raptors. Yes, sir! Everyone else with me, move out! Plo Koon has been retextured and Zatmospheric Lighting has also been updated to version 2.0, which now increases the sunniness of Scarif. Matt Clone Legions has also been updated and now includes the 332nd Company. For the first time, we'll be taking a look at Jedi Fallen Order mods. If you ever wanted to gender swap Cal Kestis, check out the female Jedi mod by Alex Poe. He also created Darth Maul Shadow Hunter, his much yellower brother Savage Opress, and a Joker Maul. And we've got some crazy Battlefront 2 works in progress. Randy the Intern from the SNL skit by Claymaver2000, Jedi Training Luke by Derfinder, Mandalore Maul by Surmi, Old Hooded Maul by Nano, Ben Kenobi by Claymaver2000, which also comes with a funny skin. An insane Darth Maul by Genazine. A completely new ATDP from Rebels by Darling. Clone Wars Clones by Sample. Guys, I'm losing my mind. Mr. Dinosaur Head Coleman Trevor by Poet. Kanan Jarrus by Hugin and Munin. And Commander Gray by however you pronounce that. That's gonna wrap this episode, guys. I've literally spent nine hours editing this video because you guys uploaded so many mods this week. Uh, I really hope you guys keep uploading mods because this is awesome and I think everyone's really happy about it. Anyways, stay tuned till next week's episode. This is Wolf 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 signing off and as always, Woof Woof.